Hi, I'm Brie Pettis. I'm Action Girl. Today we're going to make our own Rubik's Cube out of dice and magnets. Wow. First, a little Rubik's Cube history. Invented in 1974 by Erno Rubik, the Rubik's Cube first hit the shelves called the Magic Cube in 1977 in Hungary. Now in the 1980s, the Rubik's Cube soared in popularity and there are over 300 million varieties and imitations worldwide. In Rubik's Cube competitions called speed cubing, some people have been able to get their ability to solve a Rubik's Cube down to 10 seconds. I went ahead and took this one apart to put it back together. You can see there's six main faces and then all the pieces just fit in there and turn around the, these ones. Okay, we're going to do this the old fashioned way. We're going to make ours with magnets. Magnets have a polarity so we're marking each side to know which is which. We've got to give props to some folks who posted projects up on Instructables. One from G. Fixler, who originally did it with clear acrylic cubes and magnets. And another to Burz Vingian, who went ahead and made it out of dice. I created a little jig here so that I can put the dice in here and they'll be in the exact same space every time. That way I can get a hole right in the middle every time. The second most important tool in this project is the vacuum. The drill press makes a lot of little plastic bits that need to get picked up. Alright, so we set our drill press with a stop so that it only goes a certain amount of depth into your dice so that your magnet fits into it perfectly. Now it's time to use 5 minute epoxy to glue the magnets into the dice. This is great because you've got five minutes to work with and basically you've got this little turkey baster thing to dip into the glue and then dip into the dice and smush the magnets in. Now the problem is because of the polarity of magnets you have to pay real careful attention to the layouts. There are core centers, edges, and corners and if you mess it up you don't have a Rubik's Cube. Okay if we could go back in time we would have used gloves. Our hands are really sticky. Gross. Once you've got all your magnets in go ahead and take all the ones with ones on top and that's going to be your top layer. Then take all the ones with sixes and that's going to be your bottom layer. Then take all the ones with magnets on both sides and you've got a middle layer right here. Then it's time to put them together. This project took 27 dice to make. And 108 magnets each. Then all you need is the tools and you're all set to go. Oh, plus lots of glue. Now it's time for some speed cubing action. I've messed up this Rubik's Cube. Can you handle it? Okay, now it's your turn to make up a Rubik's Cube. And don't forget to take a picture of it and upload it to the Make Flickr pool. Alright, put together a Rubik's Cube. Have a great weekend. Bye!